what it's up, what it do, what it is. My name is Bianca and I came to share a biz. The biz is about the OPI college. It gets you good, it gets you freaking flawless. What's up, you guys? So today I was going to be doing something else, but plans got in the way and I had some issues with Warner Brothers. So, you know, life got just kind of hectic and everything. So since I have a huge load of OPI nail polishes, I decided to do my top 12 favorite OPIs. Starting off at number 12, we have this nice, lovely, medium-sized pink color. It's called Short Story. I don't know if you can see that, but I, I use this, you know, a lot of times when I'm going out to San Diego with my man, or sometimes when I'm going to formal events, you know, they usually allow me to wear this color. It's a nice, medium tone pink and I really love it a lot. Coming at number 11, we have this nice, lovely color. It's called Cosmo Not Tonight Honey. Now this is more of a sheer color, so with these type of colors, you got you need like five, six, seven coats and a top coat to finish it off. So, you know, I use this color a lot of times when I'm going to church and I don't really feel like, you know, dressing myself up but then again, I don't want to look plain either. So this uh, is highly, highly recommended for me. Now I have a funny story about this one. I actually worn it at one of the registered events I went to. And actually at one of the recent events I went to, a friend of mine was also wearing OPI. And she had asked me if this was got the blues for red that I had on my fingers that night. And I actually had to tell her this is, I'm not really a waitress. I don't know if you can see that. But, you know, I love this color a lot. You know, I love the designs that I can do to it and everything like that. Now, this one I have is just a regular strengthener. And it's called OPI Nail Envy. And I've been using this for the past year. And it's, it's barely hit the surface. It's just right up there. Coming at number eight, we have Russian Navy. And this one is actually from the Infinite Shine 2 collection. So I love this one, especially when I want a nice look for my photo shoots and I want to look glamorous and, you know, look out of this world, you know. Coming at number seven, we have this tan brown orangey color. It's called It's a Pizza Cake. And I've used this one a lot on my toes. And I really ain't used it on my fingers, but I'm, I'm gonna have to start because it's a full bottle. And I like to try to make the most out of my nail polishes and everything. Coming at number six, we have this Flamingo Sparkly color called pineapples have feelings too pineapples have feelings too and i've used this color a lot on top of other other colors so this is this is very very appealing to me i know it's a little dirty get, get this crap off but this is called lincoln park after dark now, this one is a very, very dark purple. That's why, you know, it represents the dark times of the night. And, you know, I've used this one a lot on my fingers, you know, for Halloween. And I've actually done the designs for a friend who I, I'll show in another video later on this year. I've done her fingernails too. So, this is Lincoln Park After Dark. Here we have number four. It is called Got the Blues for Red. And I actually allowed one of my friends at the Zumba event, allowed her to use it because I actually didn't have my purse. And she saw that I had a couple polishes in my purse from when I went to Ulta this past weekend. And I went over and uh, picked this one up. It was actually retailed at $7.50, and it's usually not $7.50, it's usually about $10 for an OPI nail polish. So this is a great polish for when you're, you know, on, on the night out, or when you're going to a vacation, 
you know, different stuff like that is gonna help you. It's gonna help you get a man, if you know what I mean. Ooh, it's dirty. But I still love it anyway. Here we have Alpine Snow. And I love Alpine Snow because it's good for the winter time. And, you know, I love the different designs that I can do with it. I actually have like a little nail art pen and I use it a lot for when I'm doing polka dots or if I'm using this as a base. And excuse the nail varnish, you know, I gotta get that off. Okay. Here at number two, we have Koala Berry. Now this is a fuchsia berry color, more of like if you ever eat wild berry skittles, um, you know they have that one skittle where it's the same color as this polish and you know this is very fun, very sexy and very promiscuous. Alright and lastly we have number one, Worth a Pretty Penny and I really love this one because it's a medium copper color and I've used this for almost every St. Patrick's Day you know I get a lot of compliments and a lot of Instagram likes for this thank you so much for watching be sure to click that subscribe button down below and until next time my name is Bianca Jordan and I'll see you in my next video